In this video, you're gonna learn about the top five B2B sales tools you should leverage for optimal efficiency. First up, Salesforce. Salesforce, HubSpot, or Pipedrive, it doesn't matter much. You just need a proper CRM system and please implement this as soon as possible. You can even use a free version. It doesn't matter. You can still upgrade to a better version. The reason why is you want to keep track of who did you had contact with? What did you communicate? How many emails did you send out? How many calls did you make? Because that will help you actually a lot to forecast, which we will cover in another video session. Okay, so Octopus is a tool Actually, in Switzerland, not many entrepreneurs use. And uh, I give you this advice here for free. Try out Octopus. There's also a free version for a month that you can try. So Octopus is actually a CRM for your LinkedIn, which you can also integrate with the CRM you're using. So if you're using HubSpot, Pipedrive, Salesforce, you can integrate Octopus. So what does Octopus do? I can tell you this is uh, some next level stuff <laughs> you can get there. So you can send automated um, friend requests to a bunch of people on LinkedIn. So actually, if you look at Cedric Waldburger's profile, he has like this astronaut in his name. So actually he did that because, so he can see if someone sends out automated messages or not, because if you say, hey, Cedric, from an automated message, you will see that astronaut as well. So that's a very smart move you did there, Cedric. But most of the people do not have this. So you can really send out automated friend requests on LinkedIn with a personalized message. And now it's even better. Once they will accept your request, you can do automated profile visits and you can do automated uh, recognition of some skills that they have on the LinkedIn profile to keep them engaged. We will also cover some other sales tools later on, but what I can tell you here is you best use Octopus in combination with other activities such as outbound emailing and cold calling. You need LinkedIn Sales Navigator anyways. Look at LinkedIn, how mighty LinkedIn is today. You have almost everyone on LinkedIn, even the Germans that refused to use LinkedIn for a long time because they had Xing. The best social media platform for, uh, for businesses is LinkedIn. So get LinkedIn Sales Navigator. You can easily get lead lists out of there that you can also integrate with other tools like Octopus or Interseller to really leverage there the, the, the contacts that you can make. Interseller um, is a very powerful tool out of the US. I recommend you guys to get Interseller together with LinkedIn Sales Navigator. So Interseller is integrated into your LinkedIn. I mean, it also works if you don't have Sales Navigator, but I strongly recommend this. Why? Because you can create a lead list out of LinkedIn Sales Navigator, and then you can put all those contacts directly into um, Interseller. Interseller will search for the email addresses in, in the background. So it's similar to Hunter. Some of you guys are familiar with Hunter. So it will just make the best guess for the email address. Disclaimer, very important. This is not illegal at all because it will search the World Wide Web for email address matches. So it's totally fine. It's also a GDPR compliant. And then what you can do is you can create a sequence and you can send it out automated to a lead list up to 500 people, I think. 250 is the standard package, but you can extend it to 500. So you can contact 500 prospects with an automated message and you don't even have to search for any email addresses. So a lot of manual qualification work will, will fall, fall away with this tool. Soapbox and Loom, this is for the, for the ones uh, like me that love to sell with a personal note. With Soapbox, Loom, Vidyard, there are many tools you can create videos of your face and they will also see your screen. So if you're showing something on your screen, you can use it if you if you send out uh, quotes in a later stage of the process, but you can also use it for, for prospecting or even show them a feature that is super highly relevant for them. I come back uh, to, to the use cases in your industry. So for example, you're selling to, let's say the automotive industry and you have a super cool use case there. You can really record a video. It has to be short, less than one minute is ideal and send them this video, they will remember you and the, the conversion rate is really high there. But also on the other hand, it's of course a lot of work to do this. So thank you so much for watching. Be sure to subscribe and watch the entire playlist so that you can learn about all Lars has to say about B2B sales. Until next time, dream big and never stop learning.